Hello everybody and welcome back to my time at Porsche, where at the moment we're kind of uh, got a few things to do. We've got to ca carry on with these conveyor belts. And also we just got the Porsche Harbour commissions and I need to make a load of igneous brick apparently. We're also trying to work on making some concrete. Now I was slightly concerned um, before that some of the commissions might already have gone. I might go and have a quick look at that and see if they have. But you guys are saying that there are some rocks um, that I have missed up the top there. Now, did I actually make these igneous bricks? I did. Right, fantastic. So we've got enough to, to do that commission and take the next one, if possible. And then we'll look at the concrete. I've got to at least get a couple of them done, you know, it, it'll be really, really cool. So let's have a quick look. So Anton, I have... Nice work. This is your payment. Thank you. 2,000 gold, which is always useful. Let's see how many are left. One, two, three, four. And there were a total of six, I think. So concrete is still there. Concrete is still there. Igneous rocks are still there. Oh no, okay, so all of them are still there. Okay, so igneous rocks take that again and immediately hand them in and I'll take one of the concrete commissions nice as well. Work. This is your payment. Thank you. I'm not actually going to bother with the mini game today because I think I need the time for other things more importantly. We'll need it in 56 days so that's 2,000. 2,000. So they're all just 2,000 each. They've got good EXP on them but it's not too much of an issue if I do miss some of them. Oh, I have the... Oh, because nice I work. have 10 concrete. This is your payment. Yeah. So I just got to go and find enough stuff for the other 20 concrete. I can at least take that. Sorry, the other 10 concrete. We can do that today. And then we can look at finishing off the conveyor belt. So this is better than I thought. And then I've got to take... The, the last one is apparently quite a bit of a annoying one to do. So... Right, I'm gonna get stuck on stuff, but then I'm gonna head straight over to the um, DD stop over by the lift. And I'm gonna go and see where these other rocks are that I have apparently missed and will possibly give me enough zeolite to finish this commission off for the concrete and then be able to take the next one. Provided Higgins, ha Higgins hasn't already taken it by the next day. We'll, we'll have to see, like, because sometimes he does literally come in and take things really quickly. And other times it's fine. Hello, Hoss. So apparently, you guys are saying that these are... I, I didn't look all the way around behind the dungeon. So I'm supposed to be looking around here somewhere. And there's another little load of rocks. Oh, there's some over here, look, for a start. See, she lab not paying attention, looking everywhere, assuming things. Good job I got you comment people to look after me. So yeah, there should be enough sea light hopefully to get the um, next bit of concrete done. We'll do that and then we'll see if I might I might be able to get it done in time. Uh, to pick it up by the end of the day, the next commission, or I might have to see whether Higgins doesn't take it in the morning. But I'll go immediately and make the concrete, and then any extra time I have, I'll work on the conveyor belts with that time. Oops. I've forgotten how many zeolite I need to make concrete with. So I'll just get all of the rocks I can. I think it might be two. I think it might be 20 I need. I've got 15 at the moment. Let's see if we can find any more. I think I saw some rocks around here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a few more here, look. I have a feeling that concrete is going to be a thing. Apparently they are already... They put a few hot fixes out because apparently there were a few bugs and crashes and things with this. Um, but they are currently working on Porsche 8 at the moment, so looking forward to seeing what they come out with for that. This has been really, really awesome so far. Porsche 7. I 
should have enough now once I get these three. Four rocks. I can't count, apparently. That should be enough. I think it's only 20 I need, but it could be a little more than that. I hope it's not 30. But I don't think I quite have 30. This is some interesting rock... Uh, some very interesting rock smashing there. Okay, so we have... 31. Alright, so if we do need three per, we have just enough. Don't have enough if we need four. I have to test out the ruins at some point. So we're still looking out for this all source key. I wonder if that's going to be some very super end game content, like getting the all source. Head into the DD stop. We're going to DD it across. We it's taken us most of the morning to dig those up, so it, I'm not sure how much time it takes to make the concrete, but uh, might not get it in by the end of the day because uh, we've got to hand it into Anton, and he isn't always around in the evening. He goes to bed pretty early, so we'll have to see. And also, the the guild will be closed. But provided they haven't been taken by the end of the day, I don't think Higgins does as much stuff on a Saturday and Sunday anyway, so I might be a bit lucky with that. Um, so let's go to the machines and see how much concrete we can make. We can make seven at the moment. Okay, fantastic. If I make five on here, that'll be done in seven hours. I'll make two on here. What are we missing? We're just missing resin, so I'll go and cut down a couple of trees while those are working. She labs a lumberjack, as always. Luckily, these sort of medium sized trees do drop resin as well, so get a couple of bits of resin from there. I don't think we're short by too many. That's three bits of resin. I've forgotten how many I need per thing. I'll just cut down all these trees and then I'll see how many more we need. But I can't convert tree sap at the moment because I'm using both blenders trying to get this done a bit quicker. So I can now make another two concrete, okay. So I need, oh, one more piece of resin. Yeah, one more piece of resin. <laughs> Typical. Okay, I, I can cut down like one more tree, I'm sure. Like this one over here usually gives me a couple. So that is the concrete all done. And then I need to work on, oh, I don't have enough stamina, really? <laughs> wow, I've done quite a lot of stuff today, clearly. Uh, what am I going to do with the rest of my day? Okay, let's have a look at the... Now, did I get... Oh, I got resin from that. Cool. I couldn't get the stump of the tree, but the, the main part of the tree helped me with my resin. So that was just enough to finish off the concrete. I only need another one. Perfect. So we've got four going there, five going there. That should be my ten. Um... The conveyor belt. Right, so how many have we done so far? Have we done any? What are we waiting for? I can't even remember. I think it's... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think we actually have enough stuff for the rubber belts, but we don't have enough stuff for the um, steel frames and stuff at the moment. So I think that's what we were stuck on. But yeah, I do love the fact that somebody, um, somebody said to me in the comments that um, you need valves to make to make the aluminium towers. Just, just take a little look at that. I have 63 valves right now. I know I will go through them quite quickly if I keep taking things for like four water towers, but I do have a reasonable little stash of them, so water towers aren't a problem at the moment. They will become one if I am not careful, but they're okay right now. So, bearings, rubber belt, steel cable, steel frame. Have I made any already? Have I made the rubber belts yet?
Doesn't look like I have started making any at all, so I, I can't see the rubber belts there. So let's see how many rubber belts I can make. Rubber belts. I can't see it. Oh my goodness. Rubber belts. 18. So that's as many as I need, which is perfect. Um, the steel frames, however, I do not have enough carbon steel bar at all to make them. But it's being... I'm, oh, right, okay. So we're making a load of charcoal over here, clearly. Probably with the purpose of making a load of carbon steel bars. So we'll just go and cancel down that. And we'll make 50 on there. We'll make 50 on here. Or 24. That's the case maybe. It's because we'd run out of charcoal. So we're still making charcoal over here. But over here. So I'll make the remaining 12 bars over here. And we've run out of iron ore. Wow, I had loads of iron ore as well. Good grief, it takes a lot. I don't have any... Um... Yeah, I don't have any stamina left today. So I can only do things that are non-stamina related. Woohoo! So, construct a light beacon. Navigation light. Well, why don't we have a little look at that then, shall we? Peoples. So, navigation light should hopefully be here now. Hopefully that... Haha, yes. So, it looks like there's something else there that was possibly also to do with the harbour. But other than that, we, we have everything now. Except for this over here. So, this here and this here. They're still missing. I wonder what they are. Oh, yeah, navigation light, sorry. Too busy wondering about things. So, navigation light, what are you? You need an advanced engine, which I have. A waterproof lamp, which I have. Aluminium plates, which I probably have. And strength and glass, which I think I have. So, yeah, that'll be a thing to make, I guess. Let's just like sort this inventory out a little more. So engines, aluminium plate. What else was it? Strength and glass. We need glass and tempering liquid for that. Do I have any glass left? Oh yeah, I do. There we are. Tempering liquid. I should have tons. In fact, no, those don't need to come out because I'll make them on the workbench and they'll take them out of the chest. That's silly to do that. Um, is it bearings? Probably. Everything needs bearings, right? Ah, waterproof lamps. Okay. So it's only the aluminium and the advanced engine I actually needed to take out. So let's see if we have enough stuff to make two waterproof lamps. First of all. Are they under furniture? I think they might be. Or even gifts. They're somewhere silly, aren't they? Right, strength and glass for that as well, but other than that, we're cool. So two strength and glass for the element for the light, for sorry, for the waterproof lamps. And then another ten strength. So twelve strength and glass, firstly. Twelve strength and glass. Two waterproof lamps. Lovely stuff. Right. Ah, they all went in the right place as well. Fantastic. So, one advanced engine. Some aluminium plates. Some strengthened glass for the outside there. And two waterproof lamps. Wonderful. Sorry guys, if my thumbnail has like a horse's butt in it, you know why. Like actually, seriously? Dude, like, off you go. Bye bye. Bye bye, bye bye. 
bye bye. Right. Let me stand in front of my my light there, looking awesome. Let's take a little selfie of it. Not with me doing that. Maybe I could be doing that. That, that looks like a good photo. Once it's been stretched. Yeah, the, the saved version of it isn't stretched like that. Save. Shame it's such a rainy, miserable day though. Okay, so I can take this actually and I can uh, go and hand that in. So how much was I going to get from that commission? I bet that's even... Uh, you get, oh, it's another 2,000. No, it's not. To light the way. 8,000 gold and 4,000 EXP for a light beacon. Don't mind if I do. Do not mind if I do at all. Hello, Mr. Musa. I made your light for you. It's awesome. It's fantastic and shiny. Oh, I'm too late to hand it in. Man. Well, unless, unless someone is behind it. Uh, behind here. They look like they might be. Oh, there's a chest here. Cool. Painting of the Lonely Windmill. Just what I needed. Yeah, it looks like they might be up here. Is, is that... Can I go in? Oh, no. If I'd have gone straight there, I would have been able to. Darn it. Oops. All right, then. What am I going to do for the rest of the day now? Can't do mining. Um, I could kill more bunnies, but I probably can't be bothered doing that. Oh, my goodness me. Right, so I think we should go and sort out my horse for a start. I maybe did this day in a bad order, actually. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We've got to ride you out, haven't we, to pet you. Okay, let's go and pet you. And feed you. Actually, Whisper's starting to be quite a, quite a nimble little horse, like... I wonder if it's better than the rental horse. I'm not sure. But we'll pet you for loyalty. To keep you a loyal horse. Because I love you. You're so beautiful. Oh, what a good horse. Your hooves are so pretty. I, you have to say something, you know? Can't just pet the horse. Right. Feels really nimble to ride now. And I do wonder whether the, the horses you own are better than the other horses. It'd be interesting to know. I need to stable you. I wasn't sure if I'd stabled her properly. And then have a look at feeding snake berries if possible. Ten snake berries every day. Nope, I want to. Okay, loyalty is much better now. <laughs> Whisper is still a little bit angry and unloyal, but not so bad anymore. So um, I would like. I think speed and endurance, recovery speed first. And then we'll look at more jumping and dash. Well, jumping probably last, I imagine. So if I train speed for the moment. I whisper all trained up. And then we might train another horse. I, I don't know, really. I don't know whether, whether that's a profitable thing or not, really. Considering you've got to feed them as well. Um, I actually kind of think it might be time for Shelab to have an early night. I don't normally do this. Oh, hang on. We could plant things, maybe? Pinky's birthday is tomorrow. Oh, good grief. I have to give her a fish or something. 
She likes wise fish, but I might only have like a catfish or something. But you know, it's better than nothing, right? It's starting to fill up now though. The more people I'm getting at two hearts and above or two stars and above, the better I am being able to see all the birthdays, which is amazing. Even if I do sometimes miss them. Mint is on the first of the oh it's on New Year's Day. Year five will be going in too soon. We are in year four at the moment. It keeps track of these things. Okay, so what I was thinking is um, I can do some inventory management. I can also do some planting of seeds. These things will both be rather useful, I think. We do have quite a full little inventory going on here. Painting needs to go in one of these chests, one of these little miscellaneous y relic -y chests. I just fill them full of junk. And then these chests have my main stuff in them. to still be there. Any concrete needs to be on my hotbar. Things I don't want to put away I'll put on my hotbar. Seems like the most sensible option. Um, I'm actually going to go all the way down to the wood chest. Maybe I should do that like most of the time. I should start with the wood chest and go up, go up from there. Well, all the wood seem to be put together. That's interesting. Stone and sand. So the igneous rock's going to start going in there as well. Marble. Uh, any sand that I may have picked up on the way, which I don't think I really have. Okay. We already have five steel frames. That might be enough to do the first conveyor belt. Some copper. Some plates. Oh, actually, plates probably go in mechanical parts as well. I want to keep things in the right places. Of course, the fabric chest should have had all that fibre in it, and it hasn't got it in it, because I'm silly. Right, mechanical parts. Engines. Bearings. Those straps are needed. Those frames are needed. Plates. Those lettuces, I'm going to keep it in the ingredients chest for llama taming purposes. I have 500 of them though. Um, I also have 42 potato fruits. Um, do I have any seeds? Honey, milk, apricots, eggs, meat. I'm going to put the apricots and the uh, potato fruit in the helper chest just so that Act has something to work with. It's a bit empty right now. Snake berries I'm going to keep for my horse. I'm just got a little bit of fur and things like that to go in the fabric chest, farming chest, resin for the wood chest. And then we have a nice tidy inventory, so if I need to suddenly go on a, a mission or something, I can just go on it. What zeolite? Is that a magical stone? Right, zeolite capsules is stone, so it will be going in my stone chest. I didn't actually know what it was. I thought it might be some sort of metal, but it is stone apparently. I'm happy to go with that. And you, and you, and you. All go in there. Still have some salad cream on me for some reason as well. A stupid boxing glove. I don't need that. It's a rubbish weapon. Farming. Poops. Many poops have been pooped on my farm, apparently. Okay, so let's um, start another conveyor belt going. And see what I need to put on it, because I might actually have enough stuff for one at least. And I've got some time to kill, so... On rear belts! Steel frame, bearing, steel cable, rubber belt. Yeah, bearings and steel cables are needed, but that's fine. Steel cables, bearings. Them down there with the concrete and the navigation light. Yeah, so that's all the stuff I need for one of them.
I just need I just need another 10 steel frames basically and I've got enough stuff to get them done so let's have a look at how we're doing with making carbon steel bars Steel bars. Oh, we still only have three. We only need five, though, don't we? So three, four, five. So that'll be, make one. Two. We need more of these working on this. I'm going to stop all the charcoal production and start on some even more carbon steel bar production. Oh yeah, I've run out of uh, run out of iron ore. Okay, yeah, let's just start making more charcoal then. Just make all the charcoal and I'll go get some more iron tomorrow. It's not gonna hurt if it takes a little while. I mean I'm making some good money now, so we're at 159,000 again. 40,000 to go. It might be worth looking to see if there's anything I can make that will give me uh, money. Now, what I want to see as well is do I still have that dream lamp recipe? Because apparently it was a bug that I had it in the first place. I may not have it anymore. Peaches amulet, arm stretcher, feather duster, crystal chandelier, waterproof lamp. Yeah, I do still have dream lamps. And they do still sell for 360 each. Wooden music boxes, 190 with bronze bars. They're silicon chips as well, though. Crystal hourglasses have been, like, really, really dumped down in price. However, I can make 43 of them, which times 30 would be about 1,500. Productive wooden flooring sells 128. Photo frame, planter boxes, displays. They sell for a lot. Iron for for something that's ironwood planks, steel plates, and stone bricks. Although I am really, really short on the carbon steel bars at the moment, but that's something that I could make later. Simple desk, 36. I still find a thing that making the crystal hourglasses is a good thing. So I have so much sand. Safety boxes. They sell for 680. Two steel plates. Yeah, I actually think that those are one of the better things then. If I make a load of manganese steel bar and a load of steel plates and stuff, I could sell them for enough. Yep, that's what I'm going to do. Safety boxes it is. So we're going to have to make a load of steel plates. So loads and loads and loads of iron will be needed tomorrow. So it's one in the morning. Uh, actually, one last thing. See, I thought I wouldn't be able to use my time without any stamina. How wrong was I? Oh, we only have lettuce seeds left. Oh, how irritating. Okay, I need to get some like potato fruit seeds or something in the morning. Like a ton of them. And they can be used as um, extras to feed the animals with. I don't want to use my lettuce. So let's just go head to bed. Head to bed, hand in all the concrete in the morning, see if we can take that last quest, which will be another couple of thousand. Um, see if we can finally finish off the conveyor belt quest, if we can just get enough carbon steel bars together for it. That quest was a nightmare, but it's going to be 18,000 gold, and it is Sunday at the moment. We have gone over the weekend with it, so we took it on Wednesday. So we've already missed out on two commissions. Unfortunately, one of the commissions was another double S rank one, so it's like, uh, <laughs> but never mind. Let's see how many have been made overnight. Like, basically zero. So let's go off and do a few bits and pieces while we wait for those. I'm definitely thinking that maybe even more furnaces would be a really good idea. However, one thing I'm kind of thinking first is that we need to go and get lubricant um, from one of the mines. It'll probably be the, the, the second mine, which is where I need to go to get iron anyway. 
Oh, we got 70 iron here, so we can make more. So I can cancel this charcoal order down. And use that 70 iron ore that I've got to make um, 14 carbon steel bars. Fantastic. This is amazing. I love having done that, that mine for Dana. That's so good. So we've got three furnaces working on that now, so we should have it in no time. I get the impression that they don't really run overnight as much as they used to, maybe? Okay, so let's see if Higgins has tried to take those other quests off the board. It is a Sunday. Again, I'm not going to do the... No, he hasn't, because that was the last that was the last one. I had this concrete one. So that's good. Nice work. This is your payment. Very good. Fantastic. So I can take the last one. That's all of them taken. So that's ten thousand goals worth of commissions there. Ten waterproof clothes. Apparently this is a bit difficult, but you got fifty six days, so I'll just plug away at it. Should I do the mini quest? To be fair... Oh, actually, I know what I'll do first. I, I might do the mini quest if I have time, but I'm going to go and see what else uh, Albert wants us to make. There's Higgins. Where's Albert? Is he in today? Or is he maybe up at church? Might be up at church. He should have a little star around him. Let me just see if he's up around the church area, around the temple. Russo and Dower both desire something, apparently. There's a DD stop over there that can be made, apparently. Oh, is he still down by the harbour? Right, that would make sense. That would make sense. He's maybe just stayed down there for a little while. Okay, cool. Let's have a look down there then. That that would make sense. I've made the, the lighthouse. Everyone's down by the harbour waiting for me to install it. So not the the navigation light. Uh yeah, there he is. Hello, mate. How you doing? Right, so wowee, this looks complicated to build. Impressive work, builder. We'll try to get this installed as soon as possible. Should be a pretty sight at night. I think it will. I think they'll look lovely once this is done. Right, so 20 relationship points with Albert as well. This is great. So, there was... That's a bit weird. Okay, so I've handed that in. It looks like that's the end of it for now. Right, okay, cool. It's just the way it was saying, like, wait for Petra or something about the lighthouse, and then it didn't give me a lighthouse quest, but I think maybe that maybe that's coming, so we'll we'll just wait for that. That's not a problem at all. I could just use the DD stop like a normal person, couldn't I? Okay, so that that does leave us with the conveyor belt to finish, which is fine. And I could find out what some of them want as well, if I want to do a bit of social. Which I might do. Hello, Ak, how are you doing? You are my good helper. Oh, there used to be so many AIs working around. It's kind of lonely to be the only one here now. What happened? Oh yeah, I was supposed to be doing like some investigating, wasn't I? Was I? The theft, yeah. Sam wants you to look around outside the research centre to see if she missed any evidence. So let's do that out. Let's do that for now. Because we've got to wait for those conve those um carbon steel bars anyway. Okay, Sam. 
You said we need to look around outside, so I'll have a look around outside. This DD stops moved into a way better position, I think. I definitely feel that's a way better place for it to be. Because if you were going to go up, because it was placed by the collapsed wasteland, but anyone wanting to go there would just go to this DD stop anyway, so. I think that was a very good plan, actually. So, she's having a look around here. No, I don't really want a group photo or anything. Um, I'm just going to look at this mission again. She definitely said outside, didn't she? The outside of the research centre to see if she missed any evidence. Right. There'll be something around. I mean, there's a chest over here, so I'll grab that anyway. Could be evidence. Oh, it's just apricot juice. Unless that's evidence. I don't think that the DD stop having moved is evidence. What am I looking for? Let's play some of these trees out. Can I? Can I do these trees? No? Are they part of like someone's garden? Is that why I'm not allowed to cut them? Clearly. Let's go look around in the trees. Around and behind here. Another chest. Chest blinking everywhere. Oh, dead end! I'll go this way, horse. Hmm. I'm not really seeing anything. Maybe I need to talk to people? Maybe I'll, well, I'll go in and just in case it's saying outside but it means inside. You never know. Oh cool, so we are at the end of all the things we need to do with the research, uh, well except for research notes. And research notes I hope will be something that will go come in in the future and be really cool. Um, so where were you keeping the locator computer? How do I find evidence? Please don't tell me this question is bugged too. I would imagine like something glowing on the floor, you know? Okay, so so far nothing around the inside that I can see. I mean, I've just had a cursory glance. There's nothing big, like, shining out at me, certainly. I'll move a chat to Sam. See if she's got anything else to say. Yo, kid, looking good. Be careful in the ruins. Don't expect me to save your butt every time, okay? She's so arrogant. I could kick your butt, Sam. Um, so we can go behind the research centre. She said, I mean, she definitely said outside. Oh, good grief. Look what we found. Look at this, guys. We found evidence. Doesn't this belong to Tuss? Hmm, let's go pay them a visit after all. They live in a cave in the Bassanio Heights. Last time we looked. Get ready for combat. I'll meet you at their hideout. Oh, very nice. Very, very nice. Yeah, so... That was well hidden. No wonder Sam didn't find that. It was very well hidden. So I'm going to go see how much more uh, work we can do on our uh, conveyor belt. Oh yeah, I wanted to go, oh no, I might not get a chance today. Go and see Sophie. I might get there in time, let's see, especially if my horse can actually have some stamina back. I wanted to get a load of potato fruit seeds just so I had something to like feed my animals with. I've got 500 lettuce now, so I think I'm okay for lettuce. 
Hello, Mrs. Sophie. How you doing? I've just come to your shop to buy some seeds. Right, so. Pumpkins. Spring and summer. We are now in autumn, coming into winter. But potato fruit can be done all year round, and I think I can feed the animals with it. So let's buy like a hundred of the seeds. I did just buy something. You are very observant. And then we can just grow loads of potato fruit. I'm pretty sure you can feed potato fruit to most of the animals. We'll get apricots as well, obviously, so anything anything that I can't feed potato fruit to, I will feed apricots to. Obviously, I wouldn't let anything starve. Okay, so... What are we doing for steel frame stuff? Probably need to grab these off the... Off the uh, furnaces. We might have enough for another one, maybe? Oh, she loves running around like a crazy person. <sighs> okay. Stone stool, help us destroy box. La la. Steel frame times four. Not quite enough. I need one more to get the fifth one, um, and then I need to wait for like another 25 to be done. So there's 25 carbon steel bars per conveyor belt. So we do need to wait for that. I do also need to, as I say, go and get lubricant. Plant my potato, you know, plant my potato seeds as well. Should I do that or should I go to the mines? Go to the mines. Potato fruit can be done all year round, and I do have apricots as well, and I do have lettuces and all sorts of other things I can feed to the animals. Now I know that the the horse doesn't need feeding all the time necessarily, possibly only when you need training as well. Um, no, not this one, I want the other one. Level two, please. So we're going to pop in here and see if we can find lubricants and on the way, uh, no I don't want to switch, not yet anyway. Yeah, I guess I need to. I do want to expand the amount of um, machines I have but I think that that might come when I get the land expansion and then also I I know how much space that new uh, assembly table is going to take up. Right, let's have a look at the dots around here and see what they tell me. That tells me it's an old part. That tells me I can't see. Tennis racket. Big iron drum. I think a spring. Lubricant. I can't even remember why I need lubricant. I need to make a crane, don't I? For, um, let me just come out of this menu. I may, need to make a crane for the... Can I not get my inventory up? Oh yeah, there we are. We need to make a crane for, not the Porsche Harbour. I need to be thinking about this waterproof cloth soon as well. Then we need to go to the hideout and beat up Huss and Tuss, but we can do that later. It's a very, very small reward for this quest, but it'll be fun. It'll just be fun to do. Um, <clears throat> Anyway, for making a construction crane, we need four lubricant to make the pulleys, that's what it is. And I might have one so far, if I'm lucky. So I need to find four lubricant at some point. That doesn't look like it. That could be. Let me just um, come out of here a second and pop over here and see if that looks at all like it might be lubricant. I don't think so. Let's 
Let's go and have a look. That was just silicon chips and things. But silicon chips are super useful because you can make um, dream lamps and stuff with them, which are really, really cool. Have a look around here. It's like a chip set of some description. Some kind of relic. That could be down there. Let's go towards it. Yeah, I think that one six meters away. I think that's lubricant. Okay, and what are you? I don't think you're lubricant. No. Let's have a look around me. See if I can find any more for any more. Okay, that's an old part. That looks like a. I think that's a can. I'll have a bit of a closer look at that. That's not. That's a iron bucket. I'm not sure what that is. That is lubricant and it's so close. Oh my goodness. Okay. So that is three, I think, now we found. Yep. And I only need four, so that's very, very cool. Let's see, there was one up there that I wasn't sure what that was. So let's just um, go and have a closer look. Could be. Just dig towards it quickly and see. It's simple circuits and data disks. Okay, that's fine. I don't mind. So once I'm done finding the lubricant, we're gonna basically be looking for more iron at that point. So actually taking things like that is always useful. Um, I, I, I'm a bit lost now, honestly. Oh, there we are. There's the surface. Right. See what else we can find. Aha! This is certainly easier than previous searches for lubricant have been. Okay, perfect. So we have enough for our crane now. Fantastic. See if I can find a nice chunky iron ore node somewhere. I think I've had all the really big ones, unfortunately. Oh, this one's decent. We've had a productive day. We've um, found out about Huss and Tuss and evidence of computer theft. No, I'm carrying on. I need as much iron as I can get. At this point, there's no point going back. I won't make it back in time, so I may as well just mine as much iron as I can and then let the furnaces burn all night and that's going to be probably be it for this episode at that point but as I say it has been a very good one we found um, some evidence that Huss and Tuss have been up to no good we finished off the light for the harbour which was fantastic and I've got the enough lubricant to finish off um, the assembly table that was all I was really waiting on for that. So we'll get all of those done in the coming, upcoming episodes, I suppose. And yeah, I'm going to keep making safes to make money, I think. I think that's my new plan. Oh, and we're down. So that manganese ore will be useful for that. So guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. And if you did, then please do leave me a like below. And if you'd like to see more Porsche, please subscribe. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, though, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.